Canelo vs Golovkin 3, trilogy match between Canelo Alvarez and Gennady Golovkin. It's official. Canelo Alvarez had already indicated, he would move back down to 168 pounds, to take on Gennady Golovkin this fall, and now they have an official announcement and date set by Diazian the third fight between Canelo and Golovkin, will take place on September the 17th. Yes, it will be streaming live on Diazian PPV, in the US and Canada, and on regular Diazian in other territories, excluding Latin America, Mexico, and Kazakhstan. Canelo is most recently coming off an apparent loss to Dmitry Bivol, in a bid to win another light heavyweight world title. While Canelo has made it clear, he still wants another bite at that apple, he'll first fulfill an obligation to a fight that Diazian and the fans prefer. Basta Sports, J. Melo. 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 That's what I follow. Basta Sports, J. Melo. Welcome to our daily dose of boxing videos. <laughs> Meanwhile, Canelo wants a rematch on Bivol. He's a guy who loves a challenge. Dmitry Bivol's overall opinion of Canelo Alvarez hasn't changed. Bivol, the WBA light heavyweight champion from Russia, stunned the boxing world by outpointing Alvarez in their 12th round, 175 pound title bout last Saturday night at T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. All three scorecards read 115, 113 in favor of Vivel, whose size, speed, and technique were too much, for the sports box office and pound for pound star. After the bout, the subdued Alvarez declared interest in activating his rematch clause. Asked if he thinks Alvarez is interested in running it back, Vivel answered pointing out that Alvarez's track record speaks for itself. The Mexican superstar is the undisputed 168-pound champion, and has won titles across four divisions. Alvarez won his first one in the division when he knocked out, Sergei Kovalev in the 11th round in 2019. Against Vivol, Alvarez was attempting to win a second light heavyweight title. Given those accomplishments, Vivol believes it is within Alvarez's character to push for a rematch. I think he wants the rematch, Vivol told IFL TV he's a guy who loves challenge. We see it, he has belts in four divisions. I think a guy like him wants a rematch. Vivol 20 11 KOs added that he would also be interested in fighting Alvarez 57-2-2. 39 KOs at the 168 pound limit, where Alvarez would gain a better advantage. Bibble, a career lightweight, has long expressed that he would go down to 168, and he reiterated that point after his win over Alvarez. However, Bibble suggested that he would need all four belts as an incentive to do that. Maybe I could make 168, but only for four belts. Bivol said. I have to think about it. I think we all have to think about it. Not only me. His team. We have negotiations. Bivol handed Alvarez, 31, only the second loss of his career. 
Alvarez's first career loss was against Floyd Mayweather Jr. in a 154-pound title fight in 2013. Basta Sports, J Mello. Basta Sports, J Mello. Kabayan, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel.